So it's been a while since I've been up this early. Um, just walking down to the end of the lane to meet a taxi uh, that's gonna take me to hospital. So I'm um, gonna have a, a day surgery today. So it'll be interesting to experience the French healthcare system again. Anyway, off we go then. That looks like a taxi. So I'm in the hospital. It's been told to sit on a comfy chair. So, here we are. show you the back of this. <laughs> no one needs to see my arms. So um, yeah, just waiting now I guess. So I've just had the pleasure of being shaved by a nice young man. Mm. From, uh, from knees to nipples. <laughs> right. So surgery's at 10 apparently. It's uh, up past eight now. Um, they just took a bunch of blood from me, almost an armful. <laughs> so, I'm gonna watch a bit of uh, watch a bit of telly, and uh, yeah, see how we go. So they just come and put some uh, compression stockings on. <laughs> Look at them bad boys. So the operation was done. Um, wasn't done till about half past two, I suppose, three o'clock. Um, <clears throat> taken down to the operating theatre, laid there about 15 minutes, I suppose. Then um, just giving the anaesthetic. Can't remember where I woke up. I think I woke up down there. They brought me back up and um, didn't have a very good night tossing and well, not tossing and turning actually, every time I tossed and turned it hurt, so um, it kept waking me up and uh, they came in and checked my blood pressure every couple of hours or so, so, uh, so yeah, um, they just took some more blood and um, the the junior doctor just told me that um, I might not even go home today. So I stand to the surgeon, he's going to see me this afternoon. So I guess we'll see. Okay. See you in a bit. So, just waiting for the taxi now to take me home. Um, didn't sleep so well last night. But um, I feel really tired, uh, a bit tender. <laughs> so, um, just as something to eat, I had, um, how French is this? I had, um, so it's the next day. I uh, came home yesterday. Um, the food I was just saying about was um, I had a uh, rabbit terrine with a little pickle and um, roast chicken and rice with a bit of gravy. It was really good actually, really good food. So um, with the with the French healthcare, um, because I wasn't able to drive myself home, um, I got a free taxi to the to the hospital and a free taxi home which was about 140 euros each way it would have been so it's really good can't fault it um i should have said earlier that um i went into hospital for a hernia operation so um 
yeah, as I say, still a bit tender, but um, uh, I'm on a bunch of painkillers and uh, and so on, so um, so that's good. So it doesn't really, it's just a bit uncomfortable, really. Um, what's curious is that my lower lip, I've lost a bit of sensation in my lower lip. When you think that the operation was down there, it feels funny. Who knew? Um, so tomorrow morning, uh, I've got a district nurse coming. She's going to change the dressings. Um, if there's one thing I would say is that I have to keep asking what to do next because um, I got a prescription from the uh, from the hospital for a district nurse to come in every two days to uh, to change the dressings and um, they just gave me a prescription and um, I didn't know what I had to do so um, I called our local pharmacy there's a lady in there Madame Ruin she's she's lovely she um uh, she booked it for me so um that's very kind of her anyway so just resting really resting um i want to keep moving about though just to make sure you know i don't all seize up and that but um yeah just keep moving and resting really so I'll speak to you tomorrow anyway. Come on, come on. What are you doing? It's this way. Come on. He's looking for his mum, I think. Come on. Oh, you're lost, aren't you? I know. Yeah, this way, look. Oh, that's it, he's gone. You lost. He's here. When I told the uh, the sheep's owner, this is uh, the lady and the man over the way there that's got the small holding. So I think they're gonna come and rescue him. Jane said he's probably gonna be first for the pot now. That's tough. He's just gone hurtling across the field there. I'm sure he'll find his way. Guess we'll see.
So the sheep got back in the field okay. I went into the farmer's field next door and uh, shooed it in, shooed it over the fence and uh, Colin rescued the day. So we just come out for a bit of a walk. I think we all need a bit of exercise. I certainly do, just to uh, stretch my legs a bit. Um, so if you can uh, like the video with a thumbs up, that'd be great. Press the notification bell so that you know when there's new videos. Maybe think about subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks to all the new subscribers and thanks to all the old subscribers. It's, uh, your support's really appreciated. Makes it all worthwhile doing this. So, all that's left to say, mine, there you go. I'll see you soon.